Okay. For me, I was already in my 20s when Chicano rap started oh. coming out. You know what I mean? Yeah. And I had grew up off of, you know, um, already, you know, started with, uh, like, Run DMC, Public Enemy. Then it went to, like, Easy e NWA. Then it went to, like, uh, like Too Short. So and you then, really got that part of it, huh? Exactly. I came up off every. I started, like, with New York and ended up fucking back in fucking in California. You know what I mean? I'm, so you followed it all the way. You, you all to, the way, bro. You got to witness before it was even in California. Yeah. Oh, I remember uh, when... Uh, you know, the biggest shit going on was fucking like Slick Rick or oh, fucking Biz Marquee and shit like that, you know? Yeah, hell yeah. And then, uh, so I followed everything. I followed every artist, every MC. I've seen everybody style rapping and all kinds of shit. So that's, you know, hip hop in general is what influenced me. And that's also why, like, I think in one way, people, uh, I, I, I get caught in the middle because. I'm Chicano, but I don't think I rap like a typical Chicano yeah. artist. Yeah. But then people see me as being Chicano and they assume I'm going to rap the like typical way. Yeah. I, I just say Chicano rap because at the end of the day, yeah, yeah. You know, uh, to, you, you we are what we are. Yeah, yeah. And and I'm not a, like, I don't bash on it. You know, people, some people do, some yeah. people don't. To some people, it's just music. To some people, it's something else. Yeah, it's more than that. What, 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 what do you see about that? Like, what do you think about that? I mean, regardless, man, we're Chicanos. Yeah. You know, as artists. Um, like I said, when I came up, there wasn't no Chicano rap. You know, um, the first Chicano we really had, obviously, was Kid Frost. You know, he came up with La Raza, and that was the first thing we heard. Uh, now, all of a sudden, Raza, we got a voice. You know, now, you know, we got somebody in hip-hop that we can hear. And then came... Um, you know the the lighter shade of brown. Um, what what'd you think about that when it came out? Like L lighter shade of brown, a lighter shade of brown. Kid Frost. Did it inspire you in a way, or or did you like just listen and put it aside? No, it it did inspire me yeah? because you know, um, like I said, at that point we didn't have a voice in hip hop. You know what I mean? So it gave me, you know, um, you know, a kid at that time. Uh, uh, you know, I didn't think about rapping at that time, but it gave me a, a an idea like, okay, I could probably do this shit. You know what I mean? Let me, you know, try it out. And um, it gave me inspiration. And then, uh, you know, uh, other artists like Lighter Shade of Brown and all that came out and they started getting more mainstream. You know, we started uh, Chicanos that were in the game now. You're hearing them on the radio. Um, you're uh, every weekend you go somewhere and someone was playing, you know. Uh, Chicanos on uh, rapping so you know it was inspirational it, it, it did open up doors and it did um, give a lot of Raza um, I think an interest in hip hop because 